फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू माय चैनल मैथ्स गुरु ओझा लेट्स डू ए वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट सम फ्रॉम एग्जामिनेशन पॉइंट ऑफ व्यू दैट इज यूक्लिस डिवीजन लेमा नाउ बिफोर डूइंग दिस सम्स हाउ टू फाइंड एस सी एफ विद द हेल्प ऑफ यूक्लिस डिवीजन लेमा वी शुड नो द टर्म लेमा व्हाट इज द मीनिंग ऑफ द टर्म व्हाट इज द मीनिंग ऑफ द वर्ड लेमा लेमा मीन्स A proven statement, which is used to prove another statement, is called lemma. So let's see here. I have written here dividend equal to divisor into quotient plus remainder. This is a lemma, which we have got, and this lemma we will use to find SCF of two given numbers or three given numbers, like one thirty-five and two twenty-five. So we understood what is lemma. it is a proven statement which is used to prove another statement is called lemma so here we are going to find scf by the method of euclid's division lemma and for that we will follow certain series of steps that series of steps we we follow to find euclid's to find scf that is called algorithm that is the series of steps which is followed to solve a particular sum is called algorithm so these two term we are going to use here so all the student must be clear about these two terms lemma and algorithm now let's see how to find scf of 135 and 225 with the help of euclid's division lemma so first of all we have to see that out of 135 and 225 which number is greater so we know that 225 is greater than 135 so what we will do now we will take 225 as dividend then 135 as divisor we will proceed the divide so we will see what we are getting if i will divide 225 by 135 it will go one time as we know 135 so if we will subtract we will get 90 so here 90 is the 90 is the remainder 90 is the remainder so once we are getting the remainder then with the help of remainder we have to divide the divisor in the next step we have to follow series of step till our remainder is zero jab tak ki zero nahi aa jata hai so let's divide 135 by 90 Let's see what we are getting. Ninety. If we will divide one thirty-five again, it will go one time. Ninety, and this time forty-five is the remainder. Again, we are getting forty-five as a remainder. So we have to continue this. Now we have to divide ninety by forty-five, and this we have to do till we are getting remainder zero. So forty-five, ninety, it will come two times. so we can see here our remainder is now zero so with the number 45 if we will divide 90 we are getting remainder zero so our scf is 45 so this is the long division method now if we will express in terms of euclid's division lemma so let's see what we have to write here we have divided 225 225 by 135 it quotient is 1 and remainder is 90 so we can see here the remainder the remainder 90 does not equal to 0 then we have to proceed further we will divide 135 by 90 so that one we have done here what we got 135 is equal to 90 quotient is 1 and remainder is 45 again our remainder 45 does not equal to 0 so we will proceed further and we can see here that uh, 90 is equal to 45 into 2 plus 0. So here remainder is 0. So our SF is what 45. So this is the way we have to solve a sum, or we have to find SF by using Euclid's division lemma. I hope this sum is very clear, and in this way, students can practice more and more so that the concept will become clear. If you like this sum, kindly share to others. so that all can understand what is euclid's division lemma and in the next class i will discuss further 
different sums based on Euclid's division lemma. Thanks for watching my channel and supporting my channel.